Welcome back to Metro Exodus. In the last episode, we were exploring the map as we very, very vaguely go in the direction of doing the main quest. But I'm not focusing on the main quest at all, I'm just doing all the millions and millions of question marks. I think I'm about to get something spit at me. Let's hide around back. Anyway, exploring on the way to the main quest, we just went to this place where we had to get the power up and going, pour some gasoline into a generator to allow us to open some doors and get all the wonderful morsels of loot inside. And then we also met a couple of the cult members over here. They seem to be gone. Oh, thanks. Anyway, next thing I want to do is take a boat over... Oh, ugh. Take a boat over to the east. Basically over there, some more question marks. I'm guessing they're gonna jump on me again, like during that one cutscene, maybe? Maybe that wasn't a specific cutscene that was meant to happen there, but maybe that's something that just happens when they get to you while you're in a boat? I don't know. Alright, that was a great boat ride. It's just the landmass I want, right? Yeah, we're on the very tip of it. Yeah, Jesus. They died on the shitter? And the shitter is made of uh tires? I don't want to use a make it if I don't have to. I might Oh no, I think I just stepped on it. I heard a little kick you. What was I saying? Sorry, I'm so distracted. Alright, let's just keep going. Oh right, I might find a home where I can just rest to get my health back. Ooh, there could be stuff over there, but there's also a lot of monsters. Not worth it. Oh, right, you can sprint further if you put your weapon down. This place is cool looking. Oh. Bandits. Don't think anyone heard that. I got the silencer on this thing. Should be fine. It's daylight though, so we're gonna get spotted super quick if anybody looks in our direction. Helmet, please be quiet. It's like a snapping turtle. <laughs> nope, don't, don't alert any... anybody. I think we're good. The battle music started for a second, but we're... we're good. Okay. How many knives do I have? Two. I also gotta remember that I have uh, tin cans that I can throw for distractions. I haven't used those since the tutorial. Man, they've got some extreme armor, like rebar and stuff. Having a party in here. No point turning off the lights, I suppose. Someone over there. They sound like they might be someone who's been captured, maybe not a bandit. 
Why am I looting this place? I should finish clearing it out. Gotta be on the lookout for people up above, too. Might be like a sniper or something. Can I, like, push this helmet so it stops making that noise? I can't. Somebody saw me. Some. Oh, hi. That's probably about it. Let's start looting. It's deeply satisfying looting stuff, knowing all the things that I can do with it, and all the things I need it for. Because you really, you really do need crafting components, even just to make ammo. You don't find much in the environment, just little scraps. Like, looting that gave me six rounds? That's actually not bad. That's on the high end. Ooh. New helmet? Mask? Thing? I can probably put that on right now, maybe? I'm not sure. No, I gotta do that back at home. Yeah. Whoops. How do we get up? Thought I'd be able to grab onto that. where I got spotted, but I don't think that's really going to take me anywhere. No, how do I get over there? I could try to do some gymnastics, I suppose. I know this is not how you're supposed to get up here, I'm sure. But hey, if it works. Heck yeah. I love the grabbing on system. Gives you a lot more freedom of movement. that base weapon? That's the revolver, isn't it? I think so. Can I turn it into a sort of sniper? It's amazing how much you can modify these weapons. It's like, <laughs> is that a sniper or a revolver? Not normally a question you ask. Oh, we can zip line a couple ways. Well, that goes back where we came from. Any more loot up here? Oh, that's how you're supposed to get up, I think. Don't see any more loot. <gasps> ah, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Let's go down this zip line. Oh, there's a couple things up here, too. So I assume if there's something orange, that... Yeah, so the orange doesn't indicate that... It doesn't just indicate that that's an attachment. It indicates that that's an attachment I don't have, I think. Because obviously this has other attachments, like the scope on it, for one. Where's that going to take me? Oh, I, apparently my goal's actually over there. I'm still not going to go there, though. 
Yeah, sure. Let's go down this way. Question mark out there. Hmm. A lot of monsters. That's fine. What do I have guns for if not monsters? Ooh, there's a lot of them. Died in one hit. Okay. All right, I'm gonna let him come over. Come on. I didn't think that hit me. Okay, these ones are stronger than the other ones. They're also blocking their face. There goes like all my medkits. Holy crap. <laughs> I have one left. Hardcore mode is not messing around. Oh. There's more. What is that? Ugh. I'm just gonna go for it. We'll see what happens. Oh, oh, so if it's too deep, yeah, you can't. You can't. You literally can't. Is there a boat nearby? There's one. Oh, but there's... There's these tracks in the way, though, that go across the water. I won't be able to get the boat, the boat past that. So I've got to find a boat on this side. Okay, we'll have to come back to that. I'll explore some more and if we find a boat somewhere over here. Are those the ones I just killed? They're covered in snow. They weren't covered in snow before, were they? Do they get more covered in snow as they lay there? Snow and frost? mark right up here. What's over there? That looks like a bandit place. Yeah, there's a person up there. Is that one of the question marks? It's not, but probably could be. I could probably just mark it right. Maybe not. Oh well. I'll check that after. I'm gonna go to the question mark first. Something so eerie, especially eerie, about post-apocalyptic industrial zones. Whoa. Bandits probably did that. Hmm, there's, lan there's a lantern here. Bandits might be here as well. Bye, Bun-Buns. I don't 
think there's anybody inside, though. No. Oh! I didn't know there's a workbench. Uh, oh! We can try out our new mask here. So, what is it? So, it's not an actual, like, replacement for the gas mask itself. It's for the other part of it, I guess. So, I'm wearing the Spartan helmet, and that's a reinforced helmet. It seems to be simply better, just a little bit better armor, and that's it. Heavier variant of the standard Spartan helmet. It employs a more advanced composite material as its base, thus providing increased ballistic protection. Yeah. Do I need to craft anything? I guess another medkit, huh? Always need to craft more medkits. Doing pretty good on ammo. Oh, we can heal here. Sweet. Although, I don't actually need to heal, so... Meh. Alright, let's go to the bandits. Can't chew one without the other one noticing. Oop. Didn't mean to do that. Just wanted to check something, like... Oh. Hmm... They started... Nope, they spotted me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they can see pretty far during the day. Um, I was trying to see if there's, like, a sort of gamey system that I wasn't expecting them to have, and they don't, where... You know how in some games you, like, zoom in on enemies at an encampment with your binoculars and it marks them so you can see exactly where they are? It doesn't have that, which is good. It shouldn't. I wonder how long it takes them to forget about you. Yeah, this thing's got- it's fairly accurate, but they're pretty far away. They're down. Okay, I need to get closer. This thing's too inaccurate for this range. Well, now they definitely all know I'm here. Oh, Jesus. Was that a shotgun? There's no way I'm going to hit them. Ah, it's too damn inaccurate. I gotta get closer. Ooh, n lots of nice little places to... ...scramble away. I don't think they know where I am. Yeah, they're all slowly approaching where they last saw me. This is a... Do they see me? Can they see me through that little crack? Whoa, whoa. Okay, the game just crashed. Okay, let's try that again. I 
don't want to wait forever for them to go around. Everyone else is going in that direction, so I should be able to take them out without other people noticing. No, that's pretty loud. Yeah, this silencer really is not very quiet. Are those like brain bits all over the ground? Did I shoot chunks out of them? <laughs> Holy shit, that person's like a tank! Okay, I just loaded a uh, save game from just a couple more minutes ago so that it actually is before I got caught. Let's try to be a bit more stealthy. I'm not trying to go for like a perfect stealth run or something, but I want to make more of an effort for stealth. It's probably just very, very difficult to do it during the day. I would imagine, but I still want to try. So I'm kind of like on the outskirts here. Ooh, looks like I can get in here around the dead body. Gross. Oh, shit. Oh, how do they not see me? be nice to take you out of the picture, buddy. We should be fine. Those are my only throwing knives, though. Such a nice bird. Look at those cool tricks. What am I looking at? Oh, it's one of the tiny babies. Oh, baby. Oh, look at the little, <laughs> look at the little arms it has up front. So ferocious, look at it, it's like rawr. It's practicing to be big. Big and strong. But not now, baby. Sure hope nobody sees me climbing up this very bright yellow ladder. Gang, don't pay for corpses. Oh, they want us alive. Well, here we go. <laughs> yeah, I think it's just too damn hard during the day. Alright, I got my shotgun, come on! I'm fortifying this place, by that I mean I'm just not gonna move. And you have to come to me. And I have a shotgun. Be explosive. Oh! 
What does that do? Uh... I keep getting super scared that they're gonna come up behind me, but they don't seem to want to come up the... I think it's the ladders, really, the only way up here. A couple ladders, one from inside, one from outside, I think. Mushroom farm. Okay, let's see what this does. Oh, it opens like a front gate. Okay. Actually, this might be related to the carriage thing, possibly. At some point in the future. I'll take that as a good omen. I just need to go down. Ooh. Someone finally had the guts to come up. And now their guts are all over the floor. Okay, they definitely don't know where I am. Obviously, they're on high alert, so they're super, super alerted for me. Oh, shit! Shoot me through the window, I think. Ooh. We okay? Did I do it? Don't. No, I hear someone else's voice. There's at least one other person. Oh, that's what that is. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have pressed that. I mean, it doesn't matter at this point. They're either up above or out back. I get the feeling that... I get the feeling that some bandits don't surrender even when almost all their people are killed. Obviously some do, but these don't seem to. Please don't be waiting for me at the top. Where are they? Oh, hold on. Look at that. That's fucked up. But also kind of funny. Oh, 
вечно в блудняк попадаю, существо. They're like, oh, they're right there. Have they given up? They might be surrendering, I can't tell. Let's go down and look. If they weren't surrendering, I don't see why they would stay back there. Yeah, okay. Ooh, I'm glad I didn't blast him. Go to sleep. Time to loot. Hey, buddy. Oh, this place is huge. I bet there's a lot to loot. It sounds like these that I don't know whether I should... Like, should I cut out all the looting? I don't know. It's really satisfying. I think I'm going to leave it in. Even though it is kind of somewhat tedious, I guess. It is interesting to look at all the stuff you find, given how incredibly detailed the environment is and the fact that I love looting. I mean, look at this. Like, what happened here? Why is there lawn clippings in the bathtub? Or moss? I don't know what that is. Or maybe someone threw up a bunch of spinach. Someone couldn't hold down their spinach. Oh, that's a cool detail. I feel sorry for the bun bun, but yeah, they went and hunted a, a bunny and then strapped it to the back of them. So they could skin it and, and eat it later. According to the loot that I got, I think that bunny counted as one chemical. Fascinating. Oh my god, you can actually crawl underneath the train. No, thank you. Yeah, they've really left this wide open for lots of little places to crawl in and through. But yeah, it just doesn't really work during the day daytime. Just too easy to be spotted. loved when I blasted somebody with a shotgun on the other side of the window and it just blasted through the window and killed them. So cool the way the glass breaks. It doesn't look that impressive when you're bashing it like that, but when you're shooting it, ah, oh, it's cool. Let's shoot some balls through it, shall we? That is so cool. Does that toilet have spikes? I guess they're just bumps. For grip? I don't know, it looks awfully uncomfortable. That or it's just very oddly placed braille? Yeah, like, can you just think of how long it would take to make stuff like this? How incredibly detailed just all these crew quarters are for just a random bandit camp? I mean, it's so lived in bottles and blankets and uh, calendars and lots and lots of bottles. Oh, it's a kitty cat. I'm not entirely sure what I'm looking at. There's a cat and then it looks like some plants. I don't know where this is all taking place though. Like, is this in a house? Is that on a bed? What is what is this part on the bottom? We just don't know. Mm. 
1980. Getting lots of new attachments. really pretty. Probably about it downstairs. I'm sure there's some stuff I missed, but let's go check upstairs. Look at this little fella. Oh no. Goodbye. They had a lot of food. Of course, they're bandits, so they probably stole it from other people. Looks like that's it. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Thought for sure I'd break my legs. Oh, hold on. That's not. No, that is it. I already looted them. Actually, I think there's a person or two up there that I haven't looted. My cat's currently rubbing the microphone, by the way, so if you hear like bumping noises, that's why. Mm, baby. I'm petting her. She's being super affectionate right now. <laughs> now that's it. <laughs> Oof. Damn, Artem. Weak legs. Let's have a little rest in the shack nearby. Um, You know what? Let's actually make it nighttime so I can do stealth better. anomaly. Very close. Alright, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're gonna check out... I think the first thing we'll check out is that teddy bear at the demon nest.